Deep beneath the waves of the East China Sea, an extraordinary engineering marvel is coming to life. It's none other than the Jintang Tunnel Project, which has left experts in the world, especially the US, amazed. This tunnel is unlike any other because it cuts right through the ocean while showcasing the incredible things humanity can accomplish. But the Jintang Tunnel is more than just a new route because it's set to transform transportation in the region. How did China manage to pull off this incredible feat? And what does this mean for the future of engineering? Join us as we reveal what China did to make American scientists shocked. China's Jintang Tunnel The Jintang Tunnel has set the world abuzz due to the incredible feats it's going to accomplish once commissioned. And this is because the tunnel is unlike any other tunnel due to the fact that it's the country's first and longest underwater passage for high-speed trains, spanning a whopping 77 kilometers with 16.2 kilometers running underwater this project showcases how far China has gone in their development. The Jintang Tunnel was unveiled on February 26, 2024 in Changsha, the capital of Hunan province. What makes this project even more incredible is the use of Dinghai and Yongzhou, which are the world's largest and widest tunnel boring machine. These machines were designed to reach depths of up to 76 meters. This tunnel is important to China because it's a key piece in solving their transportation problems by linking Ningbo East Railway Station with the Jintang, Zhoushan, and Zhoushan Islands. But how was this tunnel made, and how would it benefit mankind? Stay tuned, because what comes next will blow your mind. Built to withstand immense water pressure, the Jintang Tunnel is a good example of cutting-edge engineering. These massive pieces of equipment the Dinghai and Yongzhou, play a vital role in making the tunnel a reality. Not only is the Jintang Tunnel a key component of China's high-speed rail network, but it's also breaking records. The TBM used is the longest and widest in the world, stretching to a staggering 11 kilometers and weighing an enormous 4,350 tons, much heavier than the average TBM. These machines will eventually meet and join at the seabed before being taken apart to finish the tunnel. They need to align very precisely with a margin of error of no more than 20 millimeters, which is about the size of a five cent coin. The new Yongzhou tunnel boring machine will handle the digging on the Ningbo side of the project. The Jintang tunnel has been met with reactions and speculations around the world, and one of such reactions is from American engineers and scientists. American engineers and the broader engineering community are shocked at China's creativity, but it's clear that they are also impressed at this feat. The ambition and innovation behind this project have sparked a lot of discussion. American engineers are amazed by what's being achieved and are giving credit to the team behind it. Reports highlight that the size and complexity of the Jintang Undersea Tunnel Project are very much astonishing. Engineering experts are saying it's like nothing seen before, noting that it's about four times larger than other undersea tunnels, like the Channel Tunnel between the UK and France. It's not just the tunnel that's getting attention. The entire railway, part of the Ningbo Joshan High Speed Railway, is earning praise for its groundbreaking engineering. This is particularly for building the longest undersea shield tunnel capable of withstanding extreme water pressure. Overall, American engineers and the global engineering community are highly impressed with the Jintang Undersea Tunnel Project. They're applauding the scale, innovation, and technical expertise behind this groundbreaking infrastructure. But this is not the first time in human history that underwater tunnels have been built. Looking at the history of underwater tunnels, it's fascinating to see how far we've come. Back in the 19th century, people began seriously considering building tunnels under the sea. One of the first major projects was the Thames Tunnel in London. Completed in 1843, 
After almost two decades of effort, this project was a game changer and it would go ahead to set the stage for future underwater tunnel projects. As time passed during the 1800s, a French engineer named Mathieu Favier proposed the idea of a tunnel under the English Channel to Napoleon Bonaparte. But it wasn't until the 1960s that this idea became a reality with the Channel Tunnel linking England and France. Since then, underwater tunnels have been constructed all over the world, revolutionizing how we travel. China's incredible journey in building up its infrastructure has been nothing short of amazing. Over the past few decades, the country has transformed rapidly. China now boasts one of the largest and most impressive high-speed rail networks in the world. This network, like a web connecting major cities, has made it incredibly easy to travel and stay connected across the country. All these developments come as a shock to America and its scientists who never believed that China would reach this stage in their development. Whether it's speeding along on high-speed trains or marveling at the skyline of a bustling city, China's infrastructure journey is a testament to their commitment to progress and sustainability. One of the most exciting projects in this journey is the Jintang Tunnel Project. This tunnel project is breaking records with its size and is a shining example of China's commitment to advancing high-speed rail and underwater tunnel construction. The Jintang Marine Tunnel is a big deal for several reasons. First, it's all about connectivity and accessibility. This tunnel connects Ningbo East Railway Station with Jintang, Zhoushan, and Zhoushan Islands, making it easier for people to travel, whether they are residents, business owners, or tourists. This increased connectivity leads to more economic growth and cultural exchange, as people can move around more freely. The benefits that the Jintang Tunnel would bring to people of China cannot be overemphasized. Benefits of the Jintang Tunnel to China by reducing travel time and making transportation more efficient, the Jintang Tunnel is setting new standards in infrastructure development. The Jintang Tunnel is revolutionizing transportation in the region. It's not just making it easier for people and goods to move around. It's also a big win for businesses and everyday people. The tunnel is expected to attract more investment, tourists and jobs, further boosting the area's growth. Beyond daily use, this tunnel adds an extra layer of security to the region's transportation network. In case of an emergency or any disruptions, it provides a reliable backup route, ensuring things keep running smoothly. And here's the kicker. It's the longest marine tunnel on a high-speed line in the world, breaking records and proving China's capability to tackle even the most challenging infrastructure projects. However, the main reason for spending more money on digging the Jintang undersea tunnel for the Ningbo Zhoushan high-speed rail is to minimize the impact on the development of the Baluan port area. This port area, located on the opposite coast of Jintang Island from Ningbo port, is crucial because Ningbo port, which is the world's busiest seaport, relies heavily on the Jintang waterway for ships to enter and exit. The Jintang Waterway is also an important route for hazardous chemicals and sees tens of thousands of transport ships every year. The new container project in the Jintang port area on Jintang Island is part of the plan to integrate Ningbo and Zhoushan ports. A bridge would have had a larger impact on shipping because it would limit the clearance for navigation underneath. During the construction of the Jintang Cross Sea Bridge, for the Yongjiang Expressway to reduce disruption to shipping. The route was shifted to enter the sea from the north, crossing the Yangtze River estuary and the Grey Turtle Ocean before connecting to Jintang Island. This route had a 50,000-ton main navigation hole, but the Jintang Undersea Tunnel will go through the narrow part of the Jintang Waterway and enter the sea directly from Baluan, south of the Yongjiang River estuary. Since it is an undersea tunnel, it will not affect the free movement of ships over 100,000 tons. 
The Jintang Undersea Tunnel is the first of its kind to pass through the world's largest seaport. Such major projects often set the stage for significant development. In the early 2000s, Ningbo Zhoushan built several record-breaking and iconic transportation projects, including the Hangzhou Bay Cross Sea Bridge and the Jiaozhou Cross Sea Bridge, which spurred rapid development in the region. According to the project's feasibility study, the Ningbo Zhoushan Railway will mainly serve tourist and intercity passengers in the Yangtze River Delta region. It is planned to connect major cities such as Shanghai, Nanjing, Tianjin, Beijing, Wuhan, Xi'an, Kunming, Guangxi, Shenzhen, and others. There will also be an intercity train service between Ningbo and Zhoushan to cater to short-distance travel and support urbanization and integration in the region. The Jintang Marine Tunnel is a game-changer, enhancing connectivity, driving economic growth, sparking innovation, and strengthening transportation in the region. Now let's dive into the cool technology behind this impressive project. The tunnel boring machines, TBMs, like Dinghai and Yongju, are specially designed for tunneling under the sea. They're built tough to handle high water pressure and make the construction process highly efficient. Then there's the shield tunneling technology, which ensures safety and precision during the drilling process. This technology allows for careful drilling under the seabed without harming the environment or compromising the tunnel's structure. But that's not all. We've also got advanced underwater construction techniques at work. Think underwater welding, placing concrete, and using monitoring systems. These methods ensure the tunnel remains strong and stable, even deep under the sea. Monitoring systems, including sensors, cameras, and real-time data analysis tools, keep a close eye on the construction process, ensuring everything stays safe and on track. Innovative design and materials also play a crucial role, making the tunnel incredibly durable. These high-strength materials can withstand everything from corrosion to earthquakes. The Jintang project is a testament to China's fast development as a country. What other groundbreaking infrastructure projects around the world do you think will capture the attention of engineers and enthusiasts alike in the coming years? Let us know your opinions in the comments section below. If you enjoyed watching this video, make sure to like, share, and subscribe to our YouTube channel for more. Also, click on the next video shown on your screen. You will enjoy it.